Hey guys, welcome back to Jersey Shore Beers and Brews Reviews Roundtable. We've got another beer from Randy, the guy that is just like the head of the class. He likes to see us like, you know, the yeah, that's it. Still trying to do it right. Yeah, that's that's that's. What are we drinking? Doing it right. I don't know. Tom's River Brewing. Local. New beginnings. West Coast style double India pale ale. Double. It's a double. This thing I rings in it. The light here. This thing rings bang. Rings it's bang. A light rings bang, rings bang. Easy for you to say. It rings in at 9.1 alcohol by volume. He's hurting us. By volume. There you yes. Go. Uh, New Beginnings West Coast style double India pale ale. New Beginnings is our medium bodied West Coast IP, double IPA that we heavily dry hopped with Summer Galaxy and Citra to produce a it's aromatic. It is only Citra. It's always it? Citra. So, so they're telling you that. Some, some of these don't even tell you. Know, they, uh -huh. They're giving a couple paragraphs with a description. Yeah. You have to give them credit for that. Absolutely. To produce an aromatic beer with flavors of melon, citrus, passion fruit. Ooh. Seasons change, people change, jobs change. Hope but it's every sour. ending comes a new beginning. And we'll drink to that. Don't forget about that. Every ending has a new beginning. They should write that down somewhere. No they doubt. Right here in the back of the can. You need to remember that. So just keep that in the back of your mind forever and ever and ever. When one door closes, another door opens. And they say it right here on the beer can. Don't just count the windows. That's true. They're taking too long, so I'm gonna pour this because we're running out of battery. Just well. Make sure you, you pour this. So I guess I gotta pour mine. Took a little bit. I get a whole one? No, you, you don't. Get a whole one? No, you don't. You slip between us. Uh oh. Whoa. There's some more in here. You just Oh, I thought you were done. No, you're just your head is up. Oh, 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 okay. There we go. We're getting, we're, we almost got it there. He's doing okay. Although he had a full can to himself, so now we wait for that to balance out. Here, I'll give you a little bit. We decided to move to cans because Wayne is having a struggle clearly, as you can see, this, this with bottles. Thing. Bottles are an issue, yeah. so we're moving to cans. All right, let's give it a sniff. Uh oh. Like I said, local brewery. Tom's River. Exit 82. New Jersey Garden State Parkway. Route 37, heading west. You'll find them. Oh, Billboards. I dipped. Next to a wine. Your nose? Yep. Uh-oh. Next to a place you can you can make your own wine if you have this stuff, if you're so inclined. This just it just smells like an IPA. I'm gonna give it a little how you do. Sure, that's gonna go over well. It actually did. <laughs> no, I mean that the hop the hop. I'm excited. The hop. I'm excited for what this beer is gonna taste like because the foam alone. You're cheating. That no, is cheating. No, I'm not. I'm, I'm, uh, this is sport play. It's okay. <laughs> now let's dive into it. No, hold on. It's just hold normal on. IPA. Normal IPA. Well, that's all let's I smell. Let's go. Let's go. Okay. All right. Now, now with the double IPA, you yeah. should expect the next hot beer. This is for the last beer of the day. That's Where you go? Where you go? So with a double IPA, you should expect a very hoppy fucking finish. Nope. No. Nope. Very hoppy in your face when you taste it. Okay. And okay. then it should finish. Kind of clean. So let's go. All right, let's Ready? do it. Steady, go. Ow, my tooth. Ah. Uh, catch up, catch up. Definitely not the A. You got to yep. get the hoppy bite. Woo. Right at the very beginning. Whoa. That's got some balls. Yep, right at the beginning. Whoa. Smacks you upside the face. So if you like a good bitter, this is definitely a good beer for you because it definitely. It's a new beginning. It's a new beginning of bitter tasting. Yeah. Um, saying, well, you, not you, bad bitter tasting though. Well, yeah, well, you're, very, saying, you're using bittering as a, as a negative there. No, better, bitter sounds bitter sounds negative, but it's definitely not a negative in this one. It's, um, it's the hoppiness is forward. Because it's a better bitter. The maltiness that starts off. I mean, it's it's a very quick malt, but you got a very nice earthy malt flavor. And then it slaps and then you upside the face. And you get smacked with some hops. <laughs> and it's 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 again it's citra. Yep. It's citra. You taste the citra yep. right out. Um, if anything, I'm going to say to any brewery, including Tom Hoover Brewery, guys, citrus is a great hop. We get it, but there's so many more things out there. Okay. Okay. Let's, let's, I definitely let's, agree let's, with this. Let's let's dip into a pool where we have not just flavor and complexity, but variety. Okay. It's a very good beer, very balanced. Um, I'm digging the hops, but but. You're the same as every only, other beer. I can only have ketchup for so much before I start saying, where's my barbecue sauce? Where's uh -huh. my aioli? Where's my hollandaise? Uh -huh. So, um, really good beer, in my opinion, and we'll go to grading in a little bit, but honestly, um, you have my attention, but fucking impress me. Mmm. So behind you, bro. So behind you. 
It's a good beer. It's mealy. Well, I, I picked this beer out because I, I've been to the brewery. I, I like the brewery. I, I, I find them like having a hard time. Well, not having a hard time. Trying to find a middle of the road for, for everybody. Appreciation. Mm hmm. Because you try to go for a certain niche, you know, that's where you end up with is that niche. Now, again, for someone who's cooking, for someone who cooks. Yeah, I hate okay. yeah, chicken. This, this chicken. Is, again, a, a great chicken dish. This would have a nice. A nice, it has a nice malty sweet, like you know, start, and that 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 or a braising liquid for almost anything. Yeah, that that bittering agent at the end. Again, not bad bittering, but that that hopping agent um, would give you a very good rosemary effect. So if you like rosemary chicken, I would soak your chicken in this for two days and then throw it on the grill mm. or the broiler. Oh. Right? Oh. Are, you, are you afraid? Or even if you're, if you're really crazy, one you have you done much smoking? Of like, no, I don't I'm, own a smoker. I'm this, a smoker. Bear. This summer, so like, had, I'll pour, I'll pour I've a bottle of this in a so smoker many with three chicken breasts, four chicken breasts. I've had so many smokers over the past thirty years. It would amaze you of all, all the different ways I've cooked. I've cooked canuck, canuck, canuck. So with maple. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, I've done a couple really great. Take that, Canada. <laughs> <laughs> but and, it, and then I, when I taste an interesting beer, I say, "Wow, how can I cook with the beer?" Uh huh. And it's always it's always the comfort food that you cook with the beer with. You know what I mean? Absolutely, absolutely. Honestly, I'm not even gonna lie. This would make a pretty good brownie too. See, no one really understands that, but like with the chocolate and brownies, a good IPA in your brownie batter, that that bittering from the hot <coughs> beer cheese, the chocolate really fucking good. Beer cheese. What's that? That beer cheese dip. Oh yes. my god, y'all. Don't even go down so with, the, with the, the beer hot, cheese with, thing. Come through with that. The Bayhead Cheers Cheese Company. Oh Jesus, yep. man, take me away. Just take me away, Bayhead Cheese. And no, you don't sponsor me over here, but I'm giving you a ploy because you guys kick ass. That's for sure. Bayhead Cheese, thumbs up. The Oktoberfest. Okay, it's, it's not. I new, saw a new we've hat. Got, we've got a new hat. He saw a new hat. I, I see a new hat too. That's what she said. <laughs> oh, he's spinning the twirler. Uh, Good lord. That could get you in trouble with liquid. Yep. This is uh this is where we're at, guys. Yep, it's a good round day. Round table day, I should say. Okay. Oh. Okay. Selfie. So I guess I I have not quite reviewed this. The first yet. I'm coming in at a, at a seven eight. It's, it's it's a good beer. I mean, I would definitely drink it a couple. It's not knowing you're in, in Epic. I could eat, but uh, I'm enjoying it. Oh, hoppy, yes, so. it's definitely hoppy. But it's hard. It, there again, you know. It, Where the fuck are you reviewing it anyway? I don't know. Because we're on the camera. camera. And brought it. Okay. I you're supposed to wait. I thought you already did. Down, boy, down. <laughs> All right, well, you can I'll start. I'll start. All right, you I'll can, start. You can, you can control, so you can control the order. So we got an IPA yeah, here from Tom's River uh, Brewing Company. That is. Uh, there goes my prop. Pretty soon I'm gonna take off. <laughs> but anyway, it's a, it's an IPA, um, West Coast style. Um, it's a good IPA, West Coast style. Um, Breaking new ground? Nope. Um, IPA? Yep. Um, middle of the road. Seven five. Okay. All right, cool. So my turn. Uh, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go seven five. Also, it's 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 not jumping out at me, but it is a good double IPA for sure. It's definitely nice and um, hoppy. I'll stop saying bitter because that's 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 a, that's, a direct, that's a derogatory comment. Well, not only that, it's also a beer style. Isn't it? Yeah, so right. It's, um, it's part of the whole. I'm not thing entirely about... sure what a West Coast style idea yeah, well, is. I've had trouble with the West Coast East Coast, com you know, comparisons as yeah. well. I go by like, how do I? How is it drinkable? I rate it. I rate all my ratings on drinkability. You know, you know, how does it fit, 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 fit between what I like? Right, right, exactly. exactly. I mean, um, so so as far as rating goes, again, seven five. It's a it's a good IPA. It's 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 tasty. It's flavorful. It's, it's full bodied. 